Welcome to Broken Bushcraft. Today we're going to talk about lashings. We've done lashings before, but we're going to talk about two lashings. We're going to make some crosses, keep away vampires, and some X's to mark some treasure. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. Let's kick this off. So for our first lashing we do, we're going to do a square lashing. A square lashing, simply just making a cross, really. First thing you do is start with a clove hitch, a granny knot, anything you want to do on this one just to secure the cordage to it. Then you're going to leave a tail. Now that tail is just going to help you out later on. So let's get that out of the way. Put that over there. And since it's starting underneath, we're going to go over top and then underneath and over top and back underneath. So do this three times. Three times kind of like this magic number in this. Then once you come on the third time, you're going to thrap it. And that's where you're going to take it and you're going to go actually over this right here in between pinching the cordage. So you're going to tighten that down. Wrap it around three times. Once three times, dress it up a little bit, and now it's ready to go. Now with this, because you left this tail here, you can do a double overhand. You could do, um, you can actually finish this up with a clove hitch, whatever you want to do to finish this up. But this tail gives you an option. So that's just a basic square lashing. This is used for construction. Um, this is pretty secure, pretty tight. If you tighten it down more, and if you're not talking into the camera. So we're not always going to have pieces that are running 90 degrees. Sometimes we may have pieces that go 45. So what we're going to do this is we're going to start, go to the X. So go, this is not the perfect piece of cordage here. So go around the X. Two, three times. Clean it up a little bit. And then go through this X three times as well. Helps if you have good cord management, which I obviously am not doing today. So three around this one and three around this one. Then you're going to thrap it, which means you're going to go right in the middle there. So a tight. Three or four times. And then you can tie this off here, whatever whatever knot you want to use. And then if you have a little left over, that's fine, because especially if you want to use it for if this is like a tripod or something like that, this can hang down or you just clean this up. So this will be like be just like that. Two different lashings, really simple, really easy. And you can actually use the square lashing for this. This is just stronger, especially when you're working at these angles. So those are just two simple lashings we did, the diagonal and then the square lashing. And by the way, everything works better without paracord. Paracord does slip. So paracord is something you have to kind of tighten down a lot. But these two lashings here are gonna help you with construction later on. We're gonna build some stuff here in the future. That's kind of what I want to get into. So I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you learned something. I'll see you in the woods.